West Ham agreed fees for a trio of players. Um, well, a bit, a bit of a disgruntlement, wasn't it, over the summer? But it looks as if now David's getting his way. So we're talking about Ward Prowse uh, and Maguire as well. And also midfielder Alvarez of Ajax is also set to sign for around 35 million, Gab. You know what I like, though, about um, Maguire and Ward Prowse? Bentley said it last um, night on Drive. You know you're getting honest players. David Moyes will know he's going to get players who are leaders in your changing room. Mm. They're going to put in top performances and you know they're going to be reliable. You know every game they're going to be 7, 8 out of 10, especially Ward Prowse. Rather than going and getting a star you bring in and you don't know he's going to work, so Maka come, you know, for a lot of money. Yeah, I must admit, I didn't fancy he did, him. Yeah, he I wasn't suited, for the, times and it wasn't wasn't suited was he, for the Premier League. No. So these players are perfect for West Ham. OK, big West Ham fan Ian Abrahams. The Moose joins us now. Moose, a very good morning. Good morning, good morning. Moose. How are you? How excited are you, Moose? Oh, I think they're great signings. I mean, they really are. I mean, both players have got, you know, Premier League pedigree. They're both, you know, excellent players. They've both, I think, got a lot to play for this year as well because there's a, you know, a European Championship at the end of this, at the end of the season. So I think they're great signings. And I think they're both leaders as well, which, to be fair, West Ham do lack a little bit now that Declan Rice is gone. You know, there isn't an obvious leader in in that in that team. So, you know, I think they're, they're terrific signings. Maguire obviously needs to rebuild his confidence at club level. Um, he's been great for England still, despite his problems at Manchester United. But I think at club level, he needs to go and rebuild that confidence. And, and you know, I've always liked him as a player. I really have. Since his days at Harlan, Sheffield United, right through Leicester. And, 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 and he's, an know, he's a very honest player, isn't he? He's a very honest player. He's, he's great at bringing the ball out from the back. And, you know, to be fair, it's, it's kind of ideal you're signing both of them because the one thing that Ward Prowse we know at is, is fantastic at is set pieces. Yeah. And Maguire is brilliant at finishing them off. West Ham actually under David Moyes has been, you know, they've been good at set pieces. They've been good at scoring goals from set pieces. So this is, uh, for me, this is two really, really excellent top signings. When you talk about Harry Maguire and the centre-halves that West Ham have got, Moose, do you think Harry Maguire automatically starts in that team? Yeah, I do. Um, uh, I mean, West Ham, it's not, it, it wasn't ideally a position. I thought West Ham desperately needed someone. I mean, all right, Angelo Bono has, has been there nearly 10 years now, has had injuries. Um, but the, the starting two last year, you know, if everyone was fit, was, was probably Kurt Zuma uh, alongside um, uh, Aguirre. But the, what, it, what it gives you the option of doing now, and it, it's been muted a few times that, he, that David Moyes could do it, was to play a gear at say left back or, or play three centre half. Well, I was going to say it, he might play three at the back. He might play three at the back. Although, you know, again, technically you look at it, you think, well, you know, is Emerson really that good as a, a left wing back? Is is Sufal really that good as a right wing back? But if you do play three at the back. You can play Aguirre, you can play Zuma, and you can play Maguire. Or if you want to play a flat back four, you can move Aguirre out to left back. So, you know, I, I, I think it's he does start absolutely every week he starts. And it, yeah. it certainly makes West Ham more solid at the back. And, and uh, you know, there's a more prowess for me. I, I've always loved the way he plays. I, lo- I love, love the way he, he scores these free kicks. And, you know, the Premier League record is his for the taking. Um, and he's he's way too good to be playing in the championship. And I mean, I know it's an easy thing to say, and people go, "Well, he got relegated last year with Southampton." Yes, he did. But you know, I think he's a Premier League player. And actually, I think that you know, I'd have had him at any point in his in his career. But I still take him now. I still think he's got so much to offer. And, and you know, I, I think that this is two excellent signings. The one thing I, I'm slightly concerned about, obviously, is is the fact that uh, Manchester City is sniffing around. Lucas Paqueta but you know I mean if he does go West Ham needs to get a replacement they need to get top dollar for him and, and that means somewhere between 85 and 100 million not not the 70 that has been rumoured 85 you... well that's his buyout clause next summer so wow. yeah you think he's worth that Moose I'm well, not sure a lot of money a lot of money Moose yeah, of what he's are... worth that what about no. up front? Miss, what about you up front? Not, have you wait, got wait, 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 wait. Did you, <laughs> not watch, did you not watch the last three months of the season? He was so three months to make you, for, Miss, a good three a, months make you 85 million. million. I've seen you whinge up at buying a sandwich for like <laughs> £1.70. But 85 million, oh yeah, and the great, great well, price. In, great a year price. T- 
in a year's time, that's his buyout clause in his contract. So if if, if you want him now, you you, you I don't I know think you he's worth. I don't think he's worth eighty five no. million. Oh, oh come on, Gab. Oh, yeah, Gab, 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 come on, Gab, he's Gab, not John McGinn. Miss Goodbye, bed. Um, what, no, what, Gab, what about, what Gab, about Gab, Alan? Alan, <laughs> you saw him play against Manchester United. What do you think? Yeah, I've also seen him playing. He's, where is he? You yeah. know, he, 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 you know, he Wait, can all turn off for three months, Moose. You can say that about any player. Where you know, I mean, yeah, okay, but I think all right, fine. But yeah, West Ham. What's next? Bowie, one hundred and fifty million. No, hang on, well, hang on, Gabby. You know, West Ham. He's West Ham's player. Manchester City won him, right? That that like like we Harry Kane sixty mil player. moose into deal. I think. Oh, do me a favour. Don't, don't be ridiculous. Because listen, if if Man City really want him that badly, right? They've got to pay what West Ham want, yeah. right? If West Ham say we want eighty five, ninety million. Pay it, or it's not happening. Simple as. Miss, sorry for getting you out the wrong side of the bed this morning, this early. Why do you go and eat something, eh? Dear, oh dear, I've got 85. What about front? Quick one, Miss, because I've got to break. Up front, enough? Desperately, desperately need one or two strikers. I mean, skamak has gone. Uh, another flop in that position, but, you know, he, he's now gone. Uh, I, I'm pretty certain that Mikel Antonio will go as well. You, you, I mean, you know, I like Danny Ings, but you can't go into a Miss, season... someone texted me yesterday and said... <laughs> He's definitely. He's, <laughs> what did no. they say? I'll go on. No, I know, but he's, 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 on his, he's on his way. I, I'm <laughs> guaranteed he's on what his way. What did the message say? Yeah, I'm not telling you. Uh, Moose, thank you. Get You go back to bed, mate, okay? Thanks, Moose. 60 mil, Moose. Pick it up. Yeah, 80, deal. Gabby, done. 85, done. Gabby. Done. Gabby, 85. <laughs> Talk Sport Breakfast with Alan Brazil. Thursday and Friday morning, 6 till 10, on AM, on DAB, via the TalkSport app, and on your smart speaker. TalkSport.